Welcome back, everyone, to the next installment of Clock Tower. We just earned the unfortunate E ending for Helen, so we figured, let's go back to Gots, where he asks if we want to just send him over to try to investigate Rick, the former Barrows family butler, regarding getting the statue. At this point, we know perfectly, um, perfectly well that Sullivan does not have it, so let's go ahead and send Gots over to Rick, I guess. Would you? Sure, I'll go now. Please be careful. Okay. Oh, I see. Is that how it was? Yeah. If you know something, Gramps, tell me. Right now, I'm looking for a clue. Any clue. Hmm. Mr. Gotts, do you know of a castle called Barrow's Castle? Barrow's Castle? Yes, it is a castle in England. Then, before the Barrow's family moved? Yes, that is what I have heard over 80 years ago. Well, now things are adding up, aren't they? Curiouser and curiouser. So what's up with the castle? A monster was once born there that terrorized the local children. How's that? That'd be Scissor Man. I had always thought it a fairy tale. Well, what happened to the monster? He was killed by his father. His father was the head of the household of the 13th generation of Barrows. So the old man killed his own son. Listen, Gramps, do you know where the castle is? Give me a moment, please. I am sure that somewhere there is... What, dog? Oh, there it is. Whoa! Wow, dead! What? It's you! Jeez. Uh, Game over, I win. What? 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 What, uh... Uh, I got blah, 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 blah. Wow, wow, wow. That's how you open a chapter. Huh? That's the door. Oh god. What do I use? Not the freaking Wait, can I go can I go to the foregrounds? I can't. just took bullets it did like okay I don't know man eh. what's this am I just I guess we're going up I don't know, man. What do I do? No chandelier action for me, sorry. I guess we're going this way. Let's just take a look at Rick's house, I guess, all of it. This is out of control. Why is there never anything to use? What do I use? There's nothing to use, damn it. Can I do this? Oh, I'm dead now. Or no, I can mash. 
<laughs> Jeez. That was incredible. You know, Helen kicks him in the uh, the groin, but Rick just decks him. I mean, he's still coming, but that was freaking cool. This is absurd. now oh good a bathroom great right, am I going in please 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 am I good come on now Come on now. I'm still good. I'm still good. Okay. That was crazy. I shot him like four times. That was kind of awesome. Unbelievable. How badly do I want that demon statue? It is really hard to see. There is some detergent on the shelf. This could be used to blind someone. Powder soap. Okay, so maybe instead of using props I find items to fight Scissor Man with? I don't freaking know. This place is way more complicated than the library. Inside there is a row of coffee cups. Cool. A full cocktail cabinet. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Whoa. <laughs> okay. I think this is the door I did not check before, right? I think? Or did I use both? No, okay, I have been in here. <sighs> Wow. All right, I guess we're doing this. Damn, that's some clock tower SNES action right there. Didn't break through glass, but he certainly startled me. Once again, no mercy with this game. I do find it interesting that bathrooms are the absolute worst in most, um... Really? Okay. I do find it interesting that bathroom... Can I, can I not hide? Well, alright. Good game, good game. I had, I had a good time. Mash that panic button. BAM! I love how you just destroy him. Like, he is out. Still though, what else am I supposed to do? I can't grab these stupid little knickknacks. These aren't doors. Please open that door and leave. Okay. Like, I really don't know what to do with this guy. Can 
Can I go outside? No. I guess I'll go this way. Oh wait, no, I did this before, right? This was the dead end room. I really don't get it. Like, why is there nothing I can use? Or do I actually use the soap? Do I, can I just do that? Oh, I can. I don't know. I, thought, I didn't do it right. I was clicking the door or something. Well, I don't know what the hell to do. How do I leave? Or not how do I leave? How do I uh, like, escape? I don't know here. Here? I don't freaking know. Oh, 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 this. I can use this. This will take him out. Come on, buddy. I'm ready for you. Here it comes. Oh, do I have to match the button for this? Alright. That's bad. Oof. Unfortunate. Most unfortunate. Let's try it again. This game doesn't play around. I think I just didn't know that I was supposed to mash. Let's try it again. And they even give me a yellow bar for this. I didn't know I had to mash. Leave me alone. Alright, here we go. I'm ready. I hope. Really making you wait for it. Did I do it? Yeah. Wrecked. I really hope he doesn't jump me many more times because I don't know what I'm supposed to do about him. Like, I really... I don't know. Okay. Oh, this is the end? Alright. I feel safe. You know what? In all seriousness? Great. This music's kind of amazing, by the way. Alright, let's check the damn chair. Is like Tom and Jerry? Yeah, of course. That's just silly. And that reaction was great. Oh! Alright, well, you know what? Nowhere else in the house works. The bathroom, I think, was one time. That umbrella was absolutely one time. I don't think I've been in this room yet. That was such a dumb scare. Oh! Uh, under the bed. Can I, does that work? I could use that cabinet, too. Oh, okay. This is stupid, but alright. Wow, that's pretty stupid. That took care of him. Alright, well, he won't get me with that scare again. So far, I have not seen the Scissor Man pop up in the same place twice, which is really good. This game's keeping me on my toes. Oh, the angle is completely different too. That's cool. Oh, it even looks like the same. Like it's got the same art. There's a statue about 30 centimeters tall standing on the table. What the hell is this? Oh yeah, this has got to be that statue Teach was talking about. You know the statue. I did it. I got what I came for. So now I have to leave. Right? But I don't know how to leave. I guess I could go out the backyard. A painting by a famous artist.
this picture. It's a bit crooked. Oh. What? Something's written on the back. I found it! The location of the Barrow's Castle. You have confirmed the location of the Barrow's Castle. I've done what I came for. Now I've just got to get out of here alive. That's cool. So I might even be able to select that place on the map, which is awesome. Okay. Now I think I do want to go in the backyard. I still want to check that cabinet in the other room if Scissor Man comes after me, because that bed was apparently a one-time deal. Unfortunate, but it is what it is. I don't think I ever checked here, by the way. Oh no, I did. This is an escape, right? It simply will not open. Damn! He's locked me in, and he's taking his time to kill me. Okay, guys. Is this the way I never went? Oh yeah, that's right. I was running here to try to escape. So, okay. Something is written. Hit number eight. Cool. A wooden mask. Probably a souvenir from Africa or somewhere. Whoa, whoa! What the hell? Do it. There's no panic prompt. What am I doing? What am I, am I supposed to do something? What am I? What am I supposed to do? It's just the same stupid thing. Just have. Do I just leave? I, I can't leave. All right. What? It's not even. What? Okay, that was stupid. <laughs> Alright, I think I still have hint number 8, but I'll check that again. That was ridiculous. A china cupboard, the dishes are stacked neatly. Okay. That was freaking weird. A very heavy looking flower vase. Tries again. Ridiculous. There we go. That's pretty cool. Alright, I guess I lifted the curse on this house. What the hell, man? Ugh. Ridiculous. Meanwhile, in Orange Land... Ooh. You're not gonna eat me, are you? Whoa! That's some Resident Evil 1 action right there. I guess 2 and 3. I just mostly remember it from 1. That's insane. Well, there is a thing I can do. Think of the dog puzzle in the first Clock Tower game.
Got him. Boom. Now, I should say that with the library scenario, when Guts came and uh, saved us, and it just faded to black and cut to a movie, um, that is how the scenario should have ended. If I had chosen to give the statue to Sullivan, and I erroneously played this section as Guts, you probably would have seen the same thing. I would have run away from the dog, and it would have just faded to black, like, we couldn't do anything, and we get that ending E movie. But nope. I did the right thing. I beat it. I could save over my data now that I've cleared out the uh, the alternate option. E ending is over, and the hints before told us that the only other way to get other endings is in the last scenario, so I ought to be good. I wonder if Gods was able to get the statue all right. I'd better go to the police station. Okay. Wait a second, something looks a little, uh... Something looks a little different about this, doesn't it? Oh, that's Rick's house. Okay, I thought it might have been... Oh, oh, oh no! The, the Barrow's Castle's in freaking England. So... <laughs> Never mind. Sorry, I couldn't get the cursor to tweak it right. Alright, police station. Hi, Teach. It was my turn this time. What happened? You want to know what happened? Scissorman attacked me. I ain't got no choice but to believe in him now. Do I? Are you hurt? Now I'm okay. I got the statue too. What an intriguing case. I would love to see this scissor man. Huh? You'd regret it if you did, Prof. By the way, Teach, I found a clue. You did? Yeah, there's a castle in England called the Barrows Castle. I now know where it is. The Barrows Castle, the place where the Barrows used to live before they immigrated here. Scissorman's home. Yes, that's probably right. You want to go? No, we might learn something. Yes, let's go. Right, then... Be on the first plane in the morning to England. Fascinating. I'll go with you. We didn't ask you, Barton. Okay. So, here's something that you might find interesting. We're finally going to go to the Oslo Newspaper Company. I think Jennifer says something about a newspaper reporter called Nolan. He's south of here, though, not north, as you can see on the map. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss Helen Maxwell. You have good timing. How so? Well, we've learned a bit of information. That you are going to England? Did you find a lead? How did you find out? Well, it was easy. The assistant inspector in charge of the case is going to England. So it was a pretty easy guess. Well, I'll be. Uh, okay. How about it? May we join you? I don't mind. But I don't know if Gots will like it. Hey, no problem. We're used to him yelling at us. Alright. See you at the airport first thing in the morning. We'll be there. See you in the morning. Okay. I should stop by and see Edward. Miss Maxwell. I heard Scissorman is back. You know about it already? I just saw it on the news. 
there was another murder. Yeah, I, I mean, I guess, but that was that was a dog. By the way, we are thinking we should go back to the Granite Orphanage. I don't think Edward should be staying anywhere that there might be danger. Oh, I see. Well, we're going to England tomorrow, so I suppose this is goodbye. To England? Yes, we're going to a castle called the Barrows Castle. We are hoping to find some clues about Scissorman. May I go too? Edward, what are you saying? Well, if we don't do anything, he'll kill me too. I want to go along and help. Edward, that is... Please, Kay. Well, all right then. Please look after him, Miss Maxwell. Hmm. Well, all right. We'll be on the first flight tomorrow morning. To be fair, Edward has not been one of those annoying kids in video games. We haven't really had upkeep regarding him, so that's good. Of course, we're still not done. I wonder if anyone's there at the library. Helen, we heard you are going to the Barrows Castle in England. Well, yes. We've decided to go with you too. You have? Well, this will be a good chance to see a castle. And it sounds like fun. Yeah, okay. Oh, I see. <laughs> I guess they're coming. Alright, police station it up. Helen, are you all right? Well, yes, I was able to get the statue. And I found a clue. Right, the inspector told me about going to the Barrow's Castle. Suddenly, we've got ten people going to England. Criminy, this is supposed to be serious business. So serious, I said freaking criminy. I've contacted the police in England, and I've also arranged a rental car. From the airport, nice. Thank you, Guts. We're coming to get you, Scissorman. Oh, for God's sake. This time, you'll be doing the... Uh, yeah, running toward us. Come on, now. If you see him, what are you going to do? Attack him? Oslo Airport. That's cool. <laughs> That's pretty rad. The sun is going down. So we're actually navigating the forest. This is pretty cool. I like this. It will be dangerous to move about in the dark. Let's camp here. Ugh, camp in the woods at night. We'll be fine. It will be fine. It'll be totally fine. Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? Why wouldn't it? Strange. Where's Jennifer? Teach, have you seen Harrison and Edward? Kay is looking all over for them, but she can't find them anywhere. Oh no. Jennifer is missing too. They can't be missing. The castle, hurry. You'd better hope they're at the castle. Last scenario, Scissor Man. Oh good. Don't worry guys, this is gonna end well. It's just fine. What's wrong? <laughs> that acting. Huh, 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 huh. Ooh, what happened? Well, that was certainly eventful. For now, though, it is time to stop the installment. Well, we certainly made a lot of progress today, didn't we? We took care of the alternate scenario, too. It's pretty cool that, that exists. In this case, we played as Gots and looked for the statue ourselves, and we got it. And we know where apparently a final showdown is going to be. The Barrow's Castle in England. And everybody's there. So yeah, that sure is a lot of people in a game where you normally only need to play as one person. 
I'm thinking body count. Until next time, everyone.